to another video. Today we're going to be doing some compass or some Canterbury sightseeing with compass buses. I like the Christmas logo they have here. Helping me today, as you can see in the top right hand of the screen, is Squidgy J again. Say hi. Hello. Okay, I understand last time I tried to film a video of him, his audio was not very good, so it should hopefully be fixed. Yeah, thanks for that. Okay, either way, no. I'm going to get headed off to the depot. So this is, as I said, Canterbury sightseeing. We've made some slight edits. Basically, those are... Okay. Those basically are, instead of starting at a random stop in the middle of nowhere, we start at the bus station and then go to that random stop. Oh, and that's the same. I'll do a little bit of in cab driving and a little bit of exterior. Hello. Hello. Tour the map with us. Indeed. Mm. Uh, okay, Scott is going to be our tour guide, so he's going to be doing all the sort of announcements you get on a tour. And either way, I think I'm ready to depart when you are, Scott. Probably should press, press the reverse pedal instead of the forward. <laughs> Might help things. Leaving the bus station now, our first stop will be the race. Well, you may feel lucky to be able to see, see some cars racing on it. Oh, oh, I'm not good at driving. Great driving, driver. Looks like there's no ongoing races this time, unfortunate. Some in cab for a little bit. Here we are at the first track. We are no racing on today, sadly, so there's not much to see here. Oh, let me just turn on the in bus lighting. If I just stop here, I'll show you. It's got a nice red light up top and red lights in bottom. The driver is not the main to your lights are but you lit up red by the driver. I believe the next session will be the box song. Quite an odd choice on the reorganisers, however, we will show you it anyway. Yep, uh, next stop is Canterbury Hospital. Hospital, not has, not hospitable. Um, and we're there soon. What we allowed on the buses in some middle of the road at this point is due to the height of the And we are now approaching Cancer Hospital. This is stop number two, Cancer Hospital.
This is one of the largest medical facilities in the area, with everything including an enemy. Stop now, Squid will tell you a bit more. I love it if this is stop three. Here we have the Canterbury bus depot. Uh, this bus is maintained only by our bendy buses and general public service buses. Should probably have had my lights on for a bit longer. Oh, pressed the wrong button. We're going to be making a U-turn at the roundabout and heading into Canterbury International Airport. Squib will tell you a bit more. Squid, take it away. This is Canterbury International Airport, the main airport in the entire area. However, this airport only seems to have over around 100 flights every day. So it's not the most active airport ever, but it is the main airport in the entire area. Check them and back up so that's not right in your face. And here we are. This one's okay. This is Hadley Estate. It's the fifth stop, and this is a rather large housing suburb in in Northern Hemisphere. I hate the speed bumps here. I know, you may not really exterior driving now for a little bit. Now you see Squid's head. Next station is Canterbury Seaside. Squid, take it away. This is Canterbury Seaside, normally covered by 
nice yellow sand, but due to the rather snowy weather, it's all snowy today. This is all from Pantry Pier, where you can enjoy yourselves on the pier during summer. And winter, but it's not as much fun because it's icy and you'll probably fall and break your back. Oh, or now. Now. Yeah, just don't go there in winter. That's me on the right hand side of the bus. Wearing the red suit, big white beard. That's me. worked out well. For us then we've not been stopped at traffic lights there. This is the Canterbury Aldo, or sorry, Asda, I'm not sure if it's that. Just go ahead and take it away. So this is the Appleton Resale Park, one of the largest resale parks in the area. I was half right. Not right. Probably should have indicated there. The next station is, um, um, if I'm correct, the next station is the Park and Ride. Squid, take it away. This is Park and Ride where you can either take a short walk to the seaside or you can catch a bus after buying your car and go anywhere in Canterbury. I do like the horn on the Gemini one. You will see I do as well. Closely. It's quite well. It's obviously the Gemini one horn, but I, I mostly see it on first buses because that's my local operator. And this is the East Canterbury Adler Squid. Take it away. This is the East Canterbury Adler. Not much here apart from being near the Canterbury High School. And the rather large shopping centre, on a rather large roundabout. Glad we don't have to stop on that stop there. Where, because if you've watched the school video, uh, I had to go back and round the roundabout just to get up the hill. 
Wait, weren't you in Claps and Cousins then? When, when the worst boss is so accelerating. I don't know when his hill start though, so we would have been kind of okay in this bus. And we're coming up on our terminating station. So we'll tell you a bit more when we fill in. This is our terminating station, Gantry Station. This is the main bus station in Canterbury. Most buses, if not all buses, come here. This is also a very well known station for players. That was tiring. Yeah, I am yawning right now. Anyway, thank you, you everyone for watching. I'm uh, glad to made it to the end. Um, this is going to be the last video before Christmas. So, from the team at Mr. Gamer, we'd like to wish you a very Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, but I'll have another video in between Christmas and New Year. Well, thanks for watching. Goodbye.